Toyota has temporarily halted the dispatch of Innova Crysta, Fortuner and Hilux in India over diesel engine irregularities. It said on Monday that it was suspending shipments of 10 models that use engines linked with testing irregularities at an affiliate company. This is because Toyota Motor Corporation TMC announced that irregularities were found in the certification tests for the three diesel engine models. Its India joint venture Toyota Kiloskar Motor is temporarily suspending the dispatch of three models, Innova Crysta, Fortuner and Hilux in the country. Irregularities concern the smoothing of power and torque curves but did not lead to any overstating or overclaims on horsepower, torque or other powertrain related values. A Toyota Kiloskar Motor spokesperson said in a statement as per a PTI report. In India, the Innova Crysta, Fortuner and Hilux models account for almost a third of Toyota Kiloskar Motor's total sales. The affiliate, Toyota Industries, did not conduct proper horsepower output testing for the certification of three diesel engine models, the parent group said. Toyota Motors said it had altered the global shipments of 10 vehicles after it discovered that an affiliate had mishandled the testing of diesel engines used in the automobiles, the latest embarrassing problem to hit the world's biggest automaker in recent months. The Toyota affiliate used software to measure horsepower output that made values appear smoother with less variation. Toyota, the parent company, said in a statement on Monday. The vehicles meet engine output standards and there is no need to stop using the engines or vehicles, the company said. The issue does not have any impact on the emissions or safety of the affected vehicles, the company added. According to the report, for the cars that have already been dispatched but have not been delivered to the customer, Toyota will carefully explain them about this condition. We would like to reassure our existing customers by stating that we believe their vehicles are unaffected by these irregularities as these did not result in any variations in horsepower, torque or other powertrain related values, said Toyota Kirloskar as per the report. The automaker said the models, including the Land Cruiser 300, the High Ace, use the affected engines. Still, Toyota decided to stop shipping the 10 models that use the three diesel engines at issue. Among the models that will temporarily be shut down are the popular Hilux pickup truck and Land Cruiser 300 sport utility vehicle. Toyota has temporarily suspended production of diesel engines fitted to 10 cars including the Hilux UTA and Land Cruiser 4-wheel drive following an investigation into software manipulation by the brand's engine production arm. Toyota did not say how many vehicles were affected. Japan's Transportation Ministry said in a statement that it had ordered Toyota Industries to address its mismanagement of the engine testing, adding that it would conduct inspections and issue penalties. At a new conference, Koyochi Ito, the chief executive of Toyota Industries, apologized for the mishaps. We are extremely sorry that this was caused by Toyota Industries Corporation, he said. The cause for the program, the cause for the problem was the company system structure. Koji Seto, the chief executive of Toyota Motors, said that the problem affected the production of about 43,000 diesel engines a month. In December, Toyota was rocked by a series of recalls and production shutdowns. First, it recalled about 1 million vehicles in the United States because of an issue with airbags. Then, it reported that Japan's government was investing Dihatsu, the subsidiary for safety problems that dated back decades. Dihatsu said it would stop shipments of all its models because of the safety inspection irregularities. Last week, it said it was recalling 3,20,000 Dihatsu vehicles and it was still not ready to reopen its production facilities. Toyota said it understands the gravity of the back-to-back -back testing problems that have shaken the very foundations of the company as an automobile manufacturer. Japanese auto companies are facing their biggest business challenge since becoming global giants in the 1980s. Toyota, which in the 1970s became the leader in automotive manufacturing efficiency, has failed to keep up with changing consumer preferences and a push by governments around the world to greatly reduce the burning of fossil fuels, the main cause of climate change. Last year, China supplanted Japan as the world's largest exporter of cars. Stress charcoal? Yeah.